Now, first alert weather with meteorologist Tyler Jankowski. Great opportunity to get involved there and help out some people really in need for the it holiday season. It really is. I mean, you think about families that just can't quite make ends meet to get, you know, the gifts to their kids. It's just a, a way to help help them do that. Yeah, definitely feeling like the holidays out there. Yeah, have you guys done any decorating yet? <laughs> uh, not really, no. Still cleaning up from Thanksgiving. <laughs> you know what I got yesterday? One of those little things with a red bow and, like, Christmas tree pieces. Very nice. Like a, a, hang a, on a wreath? Door. Yeah. No, not quite, but it looks fancy. Okay. Going in that direction. That's there you go. All right, yeah, early. I have pine so. candles. That's what I usually do. <laughs> yes. So. yes. So, yeah. And we have a little snow, too, to make things there we look go. A, a little nice. I know southern Vermont got slammed with the last storm, but to the north, didn't get very much. So right now, we just have a few snow showers out there. But been checking a lot of reports at the ground, and I don't think all of this is actually reaching the ground. So flurries, I think in the strongest part of some of these bands, there could be a covering, but largely speaking, we're not talking about a lot of snow actually reaching the ground here. For example, take a look in Waterbury. See how there's the blue showing up on radar, but if we look at the camera, not much ground truth. And I think that's the case in most of the bands that we're seeing on radar. So a little snow each day through Friday, though I will say the snow tomorrow in the mountains we are talking about a couple inches in the mountains tomorrow, but not in the Champlain Valley. Not until Friday when a little clipper system comes through with the potential for an inch or two. And by Saturday, the sun returns early next week. By the way, I think we're talking about plain rain. So uh, an interesting start to winter here, how it was so cold to begin. And now at least north areas to the north, there hasn't been a lot of snow. So there are the snow showers going through the day on Futurecast. Not really adding up, I think, at most a covering in a few towns. And then tomorrow, notice how the snow is mainly along the spine of the Green Mountains in the northern Adirondacks. So I think that's where there'll be a little accumulation. And on Friday, this is that clipper system that comes through. So it's more of an organized batch of snow, an inch or two possible as we go through the day. Friday, it is colder on Friday, and then the sun comes back on Saturday. So this is the snowfall map for tomorrow mainly just the higher elevations. I think Jade Peak should do quite well. Could easily get three to six inches there tomorrow. And that's all because of this northwest wind that really favors the mountains. So highs today in the middle and upper 30s. Same deal tomorrow, but upper 20s on Friday. The weekend, Saturday looks really good, especially for skiing. Not much wind Saturday afternoon. Sunday, a different story. It clouds up. It's windy in advance of rain for Monday and Tuesday of next week. Go on.